Good morning, everyone, and welcome to my uh, video. This is probably the sixth video, six or seven. Today, we are in Seattle. Yesterday, they had us fly to Dallas to get to Seattle. Makes no sense to me. Seattle and Portland are sort of our bonus cities of the trip. There are six and seventh cities that we are looking at. Today, we are going to basically see the entire city without car. So we'll be using things like uh, lifts and scooters to get around. I'm very excited about this city. I feel like Seattle is a city that people do not talk about enough. Therefore, I do not know enough about it. It's about 55 degrees here right now, which I'm so excited about after being in places like Phoenix and Vegas where it was 108. <music> After walking around uh, Pike's Place a bit, this city reminds me of cities like LA, San Francisco, Philadelphia, and a couple of European cities as well. So if this keeps up, we're gonna love this city. Good morning from Seattle again. Today we are wandering around a ton of neighborhoods, mostly in eastern Seattle. We have a lot of streets with a lot of uh, residential and commercial stuff that we're gonna go up and down. And tomorrow I think I wanna take a boat out to one of the islands out west of Seattle. So this massive construction site right here is where a double-decker viaduct used to be called Alaskan Way Viaduct. Uh, they tore this down in 2019 and are completely revitalizing the area in order to connect Pike's Place with the waterfront. It was basically a 60-foot bridge that would have blocked this entire view that I'm standing on right now. The city across the lake from us is Bellevue, Washington. This is basically where Amazon and a couple other corporations are thinking of moving uh, now that Seattle is highly taxing people like Amazon. It's probably a 40 minute drive from Amazon. It's just directly across the lake here. Um, and it's basically just a big suburb of Seattle. Everyone plants lovely flowers and roses alongside the curb of their house. Very pretty walking through neighborhoods.
Well, it's day three and we decided that we like Seattle. Um, I think we like Seattle better than Salt Lake City. It has everything that we have been looking for in a city, but just combined. It is a very large city. We like the people here. There's so much to see, so many things to do. And we just want to explore this city more and we really enjoy this city. Uh, today we're going to Bainbridge Island which is uh, directly across the bay from Seattle to the west. I'm going to take a ferry and so that's why we're doing this.
Well, today is our second full day in Portland. We hate Portland, but today we are at a rose garden um, and a Japanese garden, which uh, should make this experience uh, slightly better. It's our third and final day in Portland, and thank God, we dislike this city. It is just a dingy city. Um, we, we don't feel comfortable here. Um, there's not a lot to do. It's overpriced. Um, it's about the same expensive uh, as Seattle would be. There's a lot of issues that no one is doing anything about in Portland, and um, no it's one like, really... It's like everyone is so liberal that they have conservative outcomes. It's, I'm also crossing the, most, the street. It's the most topsy-turvy place. Yeah, there's just so many issues, and we realized that we didn't like Portland our first 20 minutes. <laughs> yeah. And so we've just been desperately trying to find things to do. We, we looked at uh, like one or two neighborhoods on the first day. Even the hip parts of Portland are just as good as something like Charlottesville or Richmond. I mean, it's nothing completely special. No. I mean, it is, it's, it's a lot of people thinking they have something else that doesn't really exist anymore. I mean, like truly we are trying to squeeze just, just bits of fun and happiness out of Portland because I mean it's not really I like I my mood not exactly spiraling but definitely going down I think another reason is that we love Seattle so much and then we came to Portland and really what is there you know I mean we loved um, oh, we love Seattle so much that we came to Portland and just were underwhelmed by everything here today we are going to Powell's bookstore which is a massive multi-story bookstore in downtown Portland and we're here to explore. We're here on a completely empty flight from America to Denver. There's like almost no one on this. It's really probably one of like 12 people on this flight. An amazing opportunity.
Well, we got back late last night. That was our entire Seattle-Portland trip. Um, we're back in Denver right now. We loved Seattle, absolutely disliked Portland. I'm absolutely exhausted and I'm almost at the point where I'm ready to go back home. Thank you all for watching this video. Please keep keeping up with all of my road trip videos. I think I only have two more left. Bye.